but I don't want to go to Seattle. What is it you need? I could use an extra pair of eyes, and yours are keen. Will you keep watch of the battlements with my men? Is that a request or an order? I'd rather it was a request you answered yesterday. Of course I'll help. I'll have to pay you back somehow after all you've done to me. Splendid! And don't worry. I'll tell the men to relieve you later. Maybe Lord watch over you. Alright. Well, we're gonna patrol now. Now guys, I know this is a very slow beginning of a game. Now let's face it. Kinda is. But eventually I'll take that job. You won't get in there taking trespassing. Yes, the game will take the trespassing or not. Keep that in mind. My respects to you. Oh, it's actually you. Yeah, I was trying to hack it up to somebody. Yeah, hey, there's somebody down there. Proud of them. Hi, guard. Wandering around like a stray sheep. Must be your first watch, eh? I don't think anything much will be happening today. You can just lean against the wall and wait till morning. I'll show you what's going I will. Thank you. Wait till morning. Find out what's going on. And yeah, the rain stopped. Oh, I guess. Jesus. Don't come with the scallops. self-appointed king wins the love and respect of his loyal subjects. Indeed, Robard. Sigismund of Luxembourg has a rare talent for winning people over to his cause. You may be in for a surprise. I don't think he will set his heathen dogs on us today. Greetings, Lord of Tomberg. <laughs> The bastard who let the attack of Scullis and killed my parents. Don't be an idiot. Do you want to end up like them? Yes. I am Sir Mark Bart von Aulitz. I come in the name of Sigismund of Luxembourg, King of Hungary and Croatia, who has resolved to strike against those who disrupt Concord in the land and to restore order in the name of his brother, King Wenceslaus IV. Restore order. By burning and pillaging the king's estates. Greetings, Sir Markvard. The efforts of the king's brother to bring order to this chaotic land are undoubtedly noble. It seems to me, though, that he and his army have somewhat strayed. As Burgrave of Prague Castle, I am entirely beholden to the king, and here in Taunberg, divine peace reigned until your arrival. To what then do we owe the honor of your visit? Yesterday, His Majesty took action against the enemy of the kingdom, Sir Ratzik Kobila, who has been using the silver from the Scarlet's mine to fund insurrection against the crown. Unfortunately, 
the insurgent escaped. Would you happen to know, noble sir, where he might be at this time? As far as I know, the Sir Radzik of which you speak is the king's hetman at Scalitz. I find it hard to imagine that he would rebel against our king. Nevertheless, I can assure you that Sir Radzik is not a Talmud. He would be a fool indeed to flee from one castle where he has little chance of defense to another where he has even less. Or do you take the view that my humble manner is any obstacle to your army? Am I to inform the king then that the Ratzik Kobila is not a Tarnberg and that he has your loyalty? Sir Radzik Kobila is not here, and I have no intentions of getting embroiled in affairs from which I have nothing to gain. Very well, sir. As you wish. I will relay your words to the king in the hope he will be as well disposed as you seem to be. Those who have clean consciences and good will may find themselves well disposed even at moments like this, when there is little cause for joy. Farewell, sir. Auf Wiedersehen. Do that. All right, Mace Man. I want out. God be with you. Sir Robard, I need to get to Scalitz. What would you do there, lad? Sigismund might have left, but the place will be swamped with robber barons, brigands, deserters, and other vermin. And anyway, your lord commanded you to stay here. Well, I hope I have. Sir Robard, my parents died there. I can't leave them to be eaten by dogs. What would you do in my place? Sorry, lad, but I won't take orders. You'll have to wait until everything settles down, and maybe your lord will change his mind. Well, that sucks. Hmm. There are a couple things you can do here to, uh... Get out. Get a horse. One thing. Have you noticed? We can't talk to this door here to see if we convince it to get out. That's an idea. Hi, Mr. Gar. Can I get out? Good day to you. What do you need? I need to get out of here. And I need a feather bed with a comely wench in it. But it looks like we'll both be disappointed. Sir Divish gave orders not to open the gate, and you especially are not to be let out. Let me out, I say. Don't you know who I am? Someone who's about to lose his teeth if he doesn't get lost quick. Woo-hoo-hoo-hoo! I ain't find that. Never mind. May the Lord watch. 
watch over you. Okay, we're over for two trying to get out of here. Get a horse. What would I do with a horse? Oh crap, I didn't mean to talk Good day to you. Have your armor. God be with you. So there are a couple of things options you can do to try to get out of here is if you disguise yourself as one of them you could probably get out the challenge is I'm gonna be a good guy I can't I can't steal Can't do it. Oh, war's even here. Not steel. Hey. Probably do. There is a couple ways to do this, and honestly, do I have money? I have point eight. Let's see. Point eight would probably be not enough. So if I give you point eight gold, will you do it? I need to get out of here. And I need a feather. Look, I have to get out of here to bury my parents. I'd reward anyone who'd help me. He wants 15. What could a ragamuffin like you give me? Clear off before I give you a whipping. Never mind. Hmm. May the Lord watch over you. There is... Actually, there is that way you could do it. I don't remember if the thing's locked or not, though. Let's see. Up here. What you can do. Take a trip this way. Oh man, how many lockpicks? Okay. If you have a lockpick, you can buy something from the trader. But how are you gonna buy you have to steal something to get to the trader? Or we're gonna do it probably the dumbest way you possibly can. Are you ready for this? So we're gonna grab the horse here. I guess I have a horse. And, like I said, we can't go through the gate because that guard won't let us, but... We can literally... Prisoner, I'm free. I'm free. I'm out of here. Yeah, literally, that's one way you can do this. Is just literally jump off. I mean, look how much I took damage there, but it is an option. And it's way, it's like the easiest, fastest way out. Yeah. Alright. New 
Mission completed. Wait for me here, friend. Better to keep going on my own. Guys, next time on Kingdom Come Deliverance, you'll find our parents. I'll see you then.